Hey, good morning, sons and daughters of God, October 26. The peacemakers are called God's children. Matthew 5, 9 says, blessed are the peacemakers for they shall be called the children of God. Christ is the Prince of Peace and it is his mission to restore to earth and heaven the peace that sin has broken. Being justified by faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ. Whoever consents to renounce sin and open his heart to the love of Christ becomes a partaker of this heavenly peace. There is no other ground of peace than this. The grace of Christ received into the heart subdues enmity. It allays strife and fills the soul with love. He who is at peace with God and his fellow men cannot be made miserable. Envy will not be in his heart. Evil surmisings will find no room there. Hatred cannot exist. The heart that is in harmony with God is a partaker of the peace of heaven and will diffuse its blessed influence on all around. The spirit of peace will rest like dew upon hearts weary and troubled with worldly strife. Christ's followers are sent to the world with the message of peace. Whoever by the quiet, unconscious influence on a holy life shall reveal the love of Christ. Whoever by word or deed shall lead another to renounce sin and yield his heart to God is a peacemaker. And blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called the children of God. The spirit of peace is evidence of their connection with heaven. The sweet savor of Christ surrounds them. The fragrance of the life, the loveliness of the character revealed to the world, the fact that they are children of God. Men take knowledge of them that they have been with Jesus. Everyone that loveth is born of God. If any man have not the spirit of Christ, he is none of his. But as many as are led by the Spirit of God, they are the sons of God. And the remnant of Jacob shall be in the midst of many people as a dew from the Lord, as the showers upon the grass, that tarrieth not for man, nor waiteth for the sons of men. I hope you have a great day. You are a son and daughter of God.